Greetings and salutations. Welcome to Tarot Hard. Where we tarot hard with tarot cards with yours truly. The Tarot Bard. Last time we did a clarity reading for our bovine friends who are most likely to pay for Winzip. Now we will commence with a connection reading. A connection reading is what it is. A look into a bond a Taurus holds with someone special in their lives who that person is, what their challenge is, and what is the uniting force that draws you both towards each other is revealed in the cards. The first card is a look into your personality. The second will be your challenge. The third card represents your friend. The fourth card is their challenge. And finally the last card holds the uniting force that makes you two stick together like flies on shit. Let's get started. This first card represents you Taurus. Ace of Wands. Expansion. Inspiration. An extremely high energy card the Ace of Wands indicates growth and diversity. You're a person of creative powers and mass growth. Just like Minus everything you touch turns into gold. Minus the starvation. This is just so you Taurus that I can't even. Now for your challenge Taurus. And don't worry, it's not some asshole with a bolero. Five of pentacles. Sadness. Worry. Illness. Maybe the guy with the stupidly tight pants would have been better. Uh oh. <sighs> okay, don't panic. Remember what the instructor said. If you ever get into trouble, all you need to do is... Feels like I'm wearing nothing at all. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. <laughs> Stupid sexy Flanders. Sorry about this my man. But it seems that you've got your work cut out for you. Some troubling times are ahead. They may come in the form of problems at work or tensions at home. Better strap yourself in for a bumpy ride. But Taurus are the most resilient signs in the zodiac. If anyone can weather the storm it is these guys and gals. Now. Onwards. Your partner's card. Ten of pentacles. Fulfillment. Abundance. You keep good company. Your partner has sought and reached their ultimate desire. And now they mean to share in their wealth and wisdom. Because they know that they are lucky and blessed and now they desire to spread joy and knowledge wherever they go. You two and far more alike than you know. Now for your partner's card. Their challenge. Queen of Swords. Sharp. Perceptive. A woman who you can't pull the wool over her eyes, nor play a fast one on her. She is experienced and knowledgeable. But she also has a sharp tongue. Is the matter with you people? And is not afraid to use it, much to the detriment of her no good colleagues. She is honest perhaps too honest as she cuts people down with her censure and observations. Just the person you'd appreciate Taurus. And finally. The uniting force. Two of pentacles. Balance. Change. Did I not say that you two are perfect for one another? You are in perfect harmony with yourselves and each other. Your personalities and skills complement one another, works off each other's strengths, and compensate in any weak areas. A dream team to rival the world's finest. Or the master knight duo. You shall bring peace to the force. This concludes this portion dedicated to Taurus's bond. Join me next time, where we will do a crescent reading for this earthbound zodiac. Till next time. Stay enlightened.